we know router always choose best path from source to destination when we are doing routing so how it choose best path firstly highest prefix length higher the prefix length less the number of the host ip highest prefix length means this one is our source here i create one loop back loop back loop back one loop back is a logical interface it is used for testing purpose and we give ip here 1.1.1.1 255.255.255.255 1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1. Same loop back we are creating on this router also. IP is also same. Here we have router one. This one is router two, and this one is router three. Source is router one, and destination is loopback one. So for router one, our destination is loopback one. Okay. Same destination we have created on both router. Command for creating loopback. In global configuration mode. Interface. Loopback. One and then we give the IP IP address one dot one dot one dot one then submit and exit. So if the network of this path is 10.0.0.0 .0 .0 .0 .0 and network of this path is 192.168.1.0. So highest prefix length means highest subnet mask. Highest subnet mask always be preferred. Okay, so subnet mask of this route is slash 24 because this is the class C network. Any doubt? This is class C network. Any doubt in this? Please? Hello, Veda. No, sir, but how 24 can, uh, can I start once again? This one? Yeah, slash 24. Because ma'am, 192, 168, 1.0 is a class C network. So by default, subnet mask is 
प्लस ट्वेंटी फोर बाई डिफॉल्ट सब्जेक्ट मार्क्स ऑफ क्लास सी इज टू फाइव फाइव डॉट टू फाइव फाइव डॉट टू फाइव फाइव डॉट जीरो Any doubt, ma'am? Uh, no, sir. That slash twenty four uh, denotes what? That I want to. Subnet mask, ma'am. Twenty four. Means twenty four bit is for the network in class C. Eight bit in this. Oh, okay. Yeah, got it. Yeah, yeah, got it. Is it clear? Okay. So if there is. 192.168.1.0/24 and here class a network so this one is plus 8 so so which one is prefer highest prefix length highest prefix length is this one so this one is prefer for the best part okay if this one is also same both network is class a If there is also a class A network, then second point is lowest AD value is preferred. AD value means administrative distance. Administrative distance is the trustworthiness of a routing protocol. Router use AD value to select the best path when there are two or more different routes to the same destination. and we have some by default ad value like in static routing by default ad value is 1 directly connected network ad value is 0 rip protocol ad value is 120 eigrp protocol 90 and 170 ospf 110 and bgp is 20 and 200 If AD value is also same, then we prefer lowest metric. Routing protocol uses route metric value to find the best path. When we but metric always be useful in the dynamic routing. Okay, because so, static so, routing so, metric is always zero. Yes, ma'am. Uh, that AD value I did not understand what exactly it is, and what that number, how we got those numbers. One zero one one zero. This numbers, ma'am. Hello. Yes, sir. What is that administrative distance and all that? Man, administrative distance is used for choose the best path where we have multiple path available for the same destination. Okay, man. But if what these numbers like one eighty value is also same, then we prefer the lowest metric. But these numbers, how we got static for when we configure the static routing and all these things by default, this value is come. I can show you when we do okay. this practical. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Without any doubt in these things. in this point yeah okay, okay.
ओके सो हाउ वी क्रिएट लूप बैक इंटरफेस लूप बैक एंड दिस हियर एनी नंबर यू कैन गिव एनी नंबर बिटवीन दिस नंबर सो आई कैन गिव वन IP address is one dot one dot one dot one. Then we give subnet. Sir, that loop back address where it where did you come to go? Just I want to see. Mm -hmm. That loop back loop back IP. Yes, ma'am. For router, we are not given same address, right? For I come on the router one. Okay, and I am configuring the static routing IP route. And our destination is one dot one dot one dot one. Subnet mask is two five five dot two five five dot two five five dot two five five. And here we give next hop IP. So for this path, our next hop IP is ten dot zero dot zero dot two. When we send the packet, our next hop IP is ten dot zero dot zero dot two. IP of this interface. One more time, we configure IP route. We also give the subnet mask. And next path is twenty dot zero dot zero dot three. This path. And exit. Questions? Any questions? Your voice is breaking a lot. Yes, ma'am. You're also. So in routing table, we see this. Our destination is one dot one dot one slash thirty two, connected by S S. मतलब static routing, static. Okay. One is our AD value. Zero is our metric. By default, AD value of static routing is one. Metric always be zero. One route for one dot one is ten dot zero dot zero dot two, and second route is twenty dot zero dot zero dot three. It means for one destination we have two path available. So it performs by default load balancing. Okay, it means it divides the packet packet on both path. I can do ping. One dot one dot one dot one, and we check the ICMP packet. Okay, this one is ARP. ARP. <clears throat> Now, first packet sends via ten dot zero dot zero dot two. Okay. Yes, sir. Second packet sends via twenty dot zero dot zero dot three. It means it equally divided all the packet. Okay, Veda. This is our load balancing. Equally divide both the packet means like it will send packets to both the uh, routers. Both router. Same because, same packet. Because because it's assume only one dot one dot one is our destination. But, okay. Uh, how it is load balancing? I think that it is sending. A... Okay. 
Veda, please share your screen, bro. Can you see this? Hello. Yes, uh, please go on router one. Firstly, go on router one. Ma'am, can you please guide him? Yes, sir. Yes, guide him. I also see this thing. Yes. Sir. Router one. Click on router one. Every time I think I have to share this. You see it? Yeah. And so configuration. First, we need to check the configuration. Interface. Okay. Uh, uh, next router two. Uh, uh, did you start up this one? No shut. Uh, did you run that command? Okay. Uh, in that, uh, we need to run the interface. We need to run MCL, loopback configuration. Yeah. Interface. Can see you this? need to exit. You need to exit. Uh, not uh, from this route, route config. In router one. Okay. Yeah, in CLI. Uh, type the exit command. Then interface, loop back, space one. Yes, now run the IP address. Uh, address spelling, ADD. Uh, one, 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 and submit mark. No, no, enter. Only enter. You need to configure. Yeah. Yes, exit. Exit. Okay, now router. That's it. Close this. Close this and go to router 2. Configuration interface. Yeah, it's done. CLI. Interface. Look back. Space one. Space one. Yeah. Yeah. Enter. You know, IP address. Oh, I can spell it. The ADD. That's it. Yeah, now router zero. Configuration interface and uh, interface one. Interface zero, CLI. Yeah, yeah, 
Marcela. Ten I guess we need to exit once. Okay. Exit? Yeah, already it is exited. Uh, uh, no, once no, again, no. you run. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Uh, already it is exited. Yeah. IP round. IP round. No, no, IP round. Same. IP. Yeah. Yes, enter. Yeah, enter, enter. 10 dot. Same, 10 dot. No, uh, that we did in uh, uh, other interface. 10.0.0.2. So why we need to do like two times? Like yeah. why we need One to do it twice? Out, because that time you can run this command on the interface, bro. That first time, whatever it is done, <clears throat> we we ran on the interface. We should not run on that. Uh, we should come out and we should run on the router. No, no, uh, that is twenty twenty dot. Second time IP you have to route? run twenty dot. In router, in router interface too, right? Oh no 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 no, no, no. there itself it's no. Same. We have to run IP route command in global configuration mode. Okay, bro. Exit. exit so exit. first run exit command. Now one more time run IP route 20.0.0.3. 20. .0 .0 .3. 20 .0 .0 .3. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Enter. Now exit. So IP route. So IP IP route. Enter. Now it perform load balance. Okay, bro. One more time to I uh, trace route one dot one dot one. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Now please make me host. We do path manipulation. Veda, please make me. Yeah. Veda, can you run a simulation? Yeah. I gave the host. I changed the host to Ankit. Oh, okay. I think it's the is it recording, uh, Ankit? 
I don't see the recording here. No, no, the recording is running. Okay. So I feel out and everything is working. So now we want router one sent packet only 20.0.0.3. So how we do? So first method of path manipulation, we have to change the highest prefix length. So our prefix length is same on both route. We are using class A network. So second method is we have to increase the AD value, administrative distance. <coughs> because lowest AD value is always preferred. So we want only 20.0.0.3 path is used for send the packet. So what we do, go in global configuration mode. And run same command, IP route. Okay, and 10.0.0.0 on which path we increase the AD value. If I can increase the AD value of this path, so we have only one best path available 20.0.0.3 because lowest AD value is always prefer. So 10.0.0.0255 Sorry, sorry, sorry. 1.1.1.1, 1 1.255.255.255.255, and next stop IP is 10.0.0.2. And when we do shift plus question, then it asks about the AD value. We can give anything between 1 to 255. So by default, AD value of Static route is one, so we have to increase here AD value. I can write 10. Okay, so for that one, read shift plus questions, shift plus questions. Yes, what is that question like? Question mark, yes, question mark. You get these things, it asks about the distance metric for this route. Okay, so I can give 10. Now our AD value is changed and here I can run show IP route. Now you can see this. Our destination is 1.1.1 slash 32. AD value is 1. Metric is 0 via 20.0.0.3. It means only we have one best path available is 20.0.0.3. And now all the packet sends via 20.0.0.3. First packet 20.0.0.3, second packet 20.0.0.3. All the packet sends via 20.0.0.3. <clears throat> yes, bro, questions? Sir, what is that 10 you have placed? How increasing AD value? I did not understand. Increasing AD value for the if we want to choose the best path. So by default, AD value of static route is one. Okay, ma'am. Yeah, one. Uh, but uh, if I place here 20, then what it will take? <clears throat> it will take 20. For this path. I can increase the AD value for this path. So this path become our best path. Okay, ma'am. No, sir, still not. Because 
लोएस्ट एडी वैल्यू इज प्रीफर दिस थिंग इज क्लियर मैम लोएस्ट एडी वैल्यू इज प्रीफर earlier yes bro so, so both has same ad value now you changed uh, uh, the rotor one ad value right you increase the ad value of rotor one so the rotor two has the lowest value so that it prefers rotor two for the data packet transfer right yes bro uh, how okay. we can check the check the ad value of rotor one now control shift plus question mark right that's what you entered टाइम से in any case if this interface is goes down so ankit you you for checking this uh, ad value you entered shift plus question mark right so what is that shift plus question mark exactly ma'am oh, sorry bro this only for when we configure the ad value only when we configure the ad value not all this times okay bro so before configuring you entered shift plus question mark right when so i can configured conf yeah you configured first and then you i can show this when i can configure ip route this thing and when i can give shift plus question mark is ask about the ad value if we want to configure the ad value so it ask about the ad value we can configure anything yeah. between 1 to 255 i can show yeah. this only this thing okay 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 ma'am now if in any case this path is goes down in real time scenario but what i do i can do shut down command shut i can do shut down now i can run the show ip route so for 1.1.1/32 destination 10 ad value zero metric wire 10002 is our next path best path okay ma'am yes sir Veda. Okay. Any more question, bro? Hello. May I have any more question? No, sir. Okay. When this path is come up, no, sir. Go shut down. Now, best path is twenty zero zero. It means this path is become our backup path. Okay.
so i am in route 1 Please configure IP route one dot one dot one. So I'm in route one. Once again, I have to do that. Go to the router zero, ma'am. But you are doing from router one. Because my router number is different, ma'am. Oh, okay, okay. Go in global configuration mode. Yeah. IP route one dot one dot one five five. Ten zero zero two. Okay. Yeah, I missed that. Ma'am, you can give a dot between one and two five five. Please delete this. <coughs> yes. And now we do question shift plus question mark. It asks about the distance metric. Yeah. Now, exit and run command show IP. Yeah. Okay, ma'am, done? Yes, sir. Any doubt? No, sir. Veda? Hello, Veda. Yes, thank you. Ma'am, please make a host to the Veda. Yes, sir. Now, ma'am, it perform load balancing because yeah. you can give yeah. same ID value for both routes. Yeah. Okay. Whether please share the screen. Can you share the screen? Okay, go on router zero. Can you see it? Yes, uh, I am not uh, able to see your CLI. So we समझ में आ रहा है? Yes sir. नहीं आएगा तो आप बता दें। आ रहा है। Bro, yeah. Please again share your screen because we are not able to see your CLI mode. Sir, I'm not able to sign in into the tracer. Well, it is not allowing me to like uh, sign in. Only in a guest. Uh, Ma'am, we have to it. create the account on the Cisco. Yeah, it is not allowing me to. Sorry, sir. Can you see the screen now? <clears throat> yes, bro. 
non CLI. Now again, we are not able to see your CLI mode. We're losing an answer encryption. Okay. Please share your whole screen. Oh no, why I not do that? You can see this? On CLI mode. Enter. Enable. Here. Config mode. CUNF. One more time, enter. IP route. Okay. One dot one dot one two five five dot two five five dot two five five next stop IP ten dot zero dot zero dot two now shift plus question mark firstly we have to give the space to yes here we you configure test. and exit. One more time enter. Show IP route. Okay. Done, ma'am. Any doubt? Sir, uh, exactly the config mode means exactly where we are running the command and uh, the router mode that is only router. What it is like exactly? Yes, ma'am. That uh, uh, global configuration mode and uh, interface mode or whatever that route mode what those are like exactly where we are running the command global configuration mode means mm -hmm. where we are running the command and in every mode we have to run different command we can do these things uh, first day remember i can send paint also for these things <laughs> 